Welcome back to Social Club. Louis stepped in for 100% Chelsea because we're talking about Diego Costa. The elephant man. Um, he is reported to be handing in a transfer request. Mm. <laughs> um, it's rough. What do you think, Louis? Do you think that's do you think that's bollocks? Or yeah, I do because it's at least it's like at least once a month he changes his mind apparently, and yeah. it's reported like every every month there's always going he's staying. Oh no, 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 he's definitely going. No, he's staying. No, I'm definitely going. It changes. It's like it's like I, until I'm seeing it everywhere, it's like solid reports. Well, from it's an independent and ESPN. You, well, Flav, I still don't believe it. It's the case of when I sit on the BBC or Sky Sports, that's when I go. If it's not in the okay. London Evening Standard, <laughs> then it's not <laughs> real, is it? Morning but aren't you sick of him? What? Are you not, don't you, what, what do you want I was sick of him. Like I was, I was, anyway. I was, yeah, you wanted him out last, didn't you? Like, well, it, like the first half of the season, he was just going around fighting people, which was annoying me. But then sort of second half of the season, he was probably one of our best players. So it's a case of, if it's a case of Conte can harness what made him so good in the first season, where he scored all those goals, and what made him so good in the second half of this season, then, you know, obviously I want to keep him, because he's a guy that scores goals and he annoys Robbie, which is always nice to have a conversation with about after Arsenal games. But, you know, it's, um, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't want him gone. If, it, if it's, it's a case of Chelsea are in the position because we don't have European football, and we have the good enough players to play in the Champions League, hypothetically, obviously they weren't last season, um, they're not cut tied. So say Atletico Madrid did come in for him, we can just barter all we want in January if it's not worth it. I guess it, it's, it's an interesting thing because I know we're in a Liverpool situation, there's talk that we're probably just going to play one up front. So do you, how many strikers do you need if you're only going to play one guy, one guy up top? Anyway, if you sign uh, Batshuayi, 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 that's his Latin name. Um, that's the, the, the <laughs> conjugating the verb there. Um, the, do you, you know, can, can, can they afford to have two top-level guys what? fighting it out for one Conte, Conte said he's playing two strikes up top. Really? He's saying he's either doing 3-5-2 or 4-2-4. That's what he said, that's what I've read. So it's sort of like, he's going to be playing two strikes, so if anything, we need to sign maybe another striker because Remy's on the way out, which is why we've been linked with Alvaro Morata and stuff. Um, so, you know, we, we do need full strikers. If there's a way we could potentially barter with Diego Costa, so if Atletico come and say, oh yeah, we'll give you 32 million, okay, we'll give you Diego Costa and 30 million for Griezmann or something like that. It's, I'd use him as a bartering tool with what Atletico gi- What gives you the right to think you can get Griezmann? <laughs> or who's the other case of Morata? Why would he want to go to Chelsea? I don't know, mate. Why would he want to go? Answer the question, Louis. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> why would he want to go? Am, am I the one who sat there going, I'm going to do all the transfers? No, Louis, it's not. why would Morata or Griezmann ever consider I going to know. Chelsea? Robbie, why, why? Would, why would Morata or Griezmann want to go to Chelsea it's football? The money, isn't it? The that's why they all go. He could go to you for that. He could go to you for that. He could, go to you for that. He could, he could want to come to us. That's why Kante's gone to Kante's gone to Chelsea for the money. Yeah, but he could have gone to you for the money. He turned you down, actually. No, we didn't yes, turn he us did. We did. We, we weren't in for Kante. That's yes, rubbish. Did. Where do you get that I'll from? Se- I'll send you a send you thing later. Where's that from? I read it. It was on Squawker. I read it on Squawker. <laughs> it's Squawker. So care. you don't it's take Squawker. ESPN and all these things, but now you're talking about Squawker. Yeah, only because it annoys right? you. Listen, <laughs> Kante, we, didn't, we weren't in for Kante. We, we bought Granite Shaka, plays in exactly the same position. Cost 34 million quid. Why, you know, so... Sorry, we weren't in for him. Um, listen, the cost of thing, if I was you... I'd be looking to try and keep hold of Costa. He's a good player. Yeah, yes, he does bit. irritate the life. Of I am, um, but I don't think Batshuayi is as good a player as Costa. But I, um, I don't so think Diego Costa is a ter- terrific footballer. He's a good player. Yeah. I, here's the thing: like in years gone by, I'd have never, I'd have never got it. But having had Suarez and having that guy who goes out and he's got that, he's got that needle about him. Yeah. I, I, I do, I do like that. He would have been the perfect kind of like you know just, just. Just monster to put up front if we to lose that. But that being said, it, it, can he get back up to that level? Because ultimately, we know with Chelsea, it's where formerly world class centre forwards go to die. <laughs> so you know it, that could be is Costa able to get himself back up to that level? Because you, you know players do have a limited shelf life at the very top. Yeah, he's he, Costa. All jokes aside, was is probably the striker I least like like to face. One because he's, he's a wind up merchant and he's so good at that. But as part of his game, it's fine. Suarez was as well, um, but he, he's, just, he, he's so powerful. He attacks the attacks the game in the right way, and I just I'd love to see him go because it's a nightmare playing against him. Absolute nightmare. And he had a bad season last year, but he did finish well, as Louis says. Mm. 
I, if I was Conte, I'd be doing any everything I could to keep. But we were talking about like the problems like when Alden and uh, Soko had, and we said ultimately, you know, you will have peaks and troughs when you're playing for a not a very good team, yeah. uh, which is what he was in last year. I think the thing is at the moment, right? If you've got, you I cannot afford to lose quality strikers because yeah. there's not a lot of top quality strikers around at the moment. So, you know, if Costa Mr. does, Mr. Wenger. Yeah, well, you? we're we're on the hunt. We can't find one. You know what I mean, so <laughs> well, it's, 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 uh? like is it? Well, yeah, but did, did, yeah, these are, did, yeah, but Higuain's eighty million pounds. No, it's, yeah, it's a, it's a case of are they? I'm saying if it, to get somebody of a similar level, are they available? To Costa, what are you going to have to spend to bring that in? So oh, right. they, t I think Chelsea need to really try and I hold on to. I think Arsenal should move. Diego Costa. Oh my God! That would fix you. That would be the last. Yeah, but Chelsea pass. would never sell Diego Costa. To that was the worst thing on earth. Costa huh? at Arsenal. I just don't know if I could cope with that. <laughs> <laughs> Chelsea would never sell Diego Costa to Arsenal. Um, Atletico Madrid would be a good move for him. You know what I mean? He, mm. he was obviously he, they loved him there, mm. and he worked well under Simeone. But I just think that Chelsea they can't afford to they can't afford to lose him. You know, the guys that we're talking about, Lacazette and that. Uh, up and coming guys still they still to do it at that real high level yeah. Costa has done it there so yeah, you're right. it's, that'd be a glass, bad miss the, if he lost it the glass is always green isn't it, in those situations and I think with Diego Costa you have to take the rough with the smooth to some, to some extent and that's yeah. just his face mm. um, but you know it's just <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> Look, exactly what Robbie's saying there. The guy's the guy's goals. He's proven goals. He's pre proven Premier League goals, and it's very easy to go, oh well, whatever. Kind of, we'll, we'll get rid of whatever. But I think that would be that's a that's a big loss. And you know, where Chelsea have struggled in recent seasons is when you've not had a go-to guy up front. Look at Denver three Bar, seasons Torres. ago. Exactly, well, that, that was that exactly. Was a horrible you had guys who were formally top quality but you didn't have that one guy you go out and you get Costa and all of a sudden you've got oh, what it takes ringing. that's that's yeah, Costa's that, agents looking to make it happen like yeah there you go <laughs> <laughs> but yeah you know having those having those options you've Room got is it ESPN guys. right <laughs> <laughs> anyway let us know your thoughts for we'll wrap up there um you know would it be a smart move from Diego Costa to move from Chelsea now? Should he stay for another season? If he were to move, would you have a Diego Costa at your, at your team? Uh, Robbie would. Robbie would be all over it. I would have Diego Costa. I hate your guys' guts because they're Chelsea. I'm just, if, if, but if I'm being 100% honest, I'd have to say, yeah, I would. If he stays, if he stays, when Robbie talks to me, if Diego Costa's wound someone up at Arsenal, I'm going to just run this video. No, but run I, this video. No, but on I, Arsenal fan TV, I'm just going to, Robbie, what did you say? What'd you can run the video. No, I'm what telling you now. Wait a minute, I hate him. I hate Chelsea. I hate Diego Costa. And I hate but, you. Right? <laughs> but I am I am honest enough to admit that he's a very, very good player. With, with me, I'm Fair honest. Fair I'm fun. honest when it comes to football. But that doesn't mean I've got to like him, does it? Are you wrapping it up, mate? <laughs> I like him if he comes to him. Robbie's being honest. Stay for more Robbie Honesty. Go and check out the Man Like Robbie channel. Uh, that's what it's there Always for. Honest, Always honest, Always honest, me. Uh, if you haven't done so already, do subscribe to the Ball Street YouTube channel. Check out the rest of Social Club.